Good morning, guys. Today is Sunday. I don't have any kids. I have no plans. So you know what? I'm going to go thrifting and I'm going to take you guys with me. Let's go. Good morning, family. Good morning, family. Don't forget, grow some trees, grow some food, grow something. Let's get started.
right, so as you guys can see, I've been doing a little thrifting. One of the things I always look for when I go thrifting are black books. If you grew up here in America like me, especially from the 70s, 80s, and the 90s, you know that there was not too many things out there that we saw in school, as in books, movies, worksheets, anything that had anything on there that people like me could identify with. Just about everything I seen growing up, including television programs, were all Caucasians. So I make a point that when I go to get books, movies, anything like that for my kids and for my grandkids that I try to find things that they can identify with. So when I go thrifting, I always look for black books. And last night, I ended up finding four. I found a couple more last week and I will show you those in just a moment. All right, so these are the books that I found last week, and they are all hardcover, beautiful color books, full color books. And uh, we've read all of them except for one already. The kids love them. They love being able to open the books and see people who actually look like them. They can identify with the people in the stories, and it also teaches them about their history and the possibility of their future. So my daughter collects these little heads. I don't know too much about them, but I know when I seen this one and it's creepy and she likes creepy things. So <laughs> I actually FaceTimed her while I was in the store and she's like, get it, get it. So I guess he's from some scary movie and I uh, had to pick him up for her. So he was only $4.99. So these were actually a great find. These were $2.99. And I actually have the cards to these. It's a set of cards with all different patterns and everything on there. And you need these little pieces to kind of like put a puzzle together. You know, you just kind of place them on the spots on the pattern on each card. And uh, it helps the kids with hand-eye coordination. Um, things like, you know, figuring out puzzles and shapes colors. They're pretty cool. And uh, I've had those cards for a while, so some of the shapes are definitely missing. And finding this entire bag full for $3 was definitely a win for me. And then we do a lot of puzzles around here, especially in the kids' downtime. And uh, this is four wooden puzzles, which is what I prefer. And uh, pretty cute. They're Toy Story. They're brand new, still completely sealed in the package. And uh, they were also $4.99. So I'm going to film these outside because, like I said, my house was built in 1941. It's a little California bungalow. And uh, it's pretty dark inside. So I'll show you guys the glass that I picked up. I told you guys that I love all things green. So anytime I come across green things, I just got to pick them up. And this is a pattern that I'm already collecting. So I got all of the ones that are this size for $9.99. And the larger ones were $7.99 for all of them. So this is another pattern that I also collect. I absolutely adore this pattern. I love this ivy. And um, it was supposed to be a set of six for, I think they said $5.99. Somebody bought all the other pieces and left that one. Then there was this little cup. It was also supposed to be a set of two. And so was this one. So they ended up giving me all of the china for $5.99. I actually have the saucer to this cup and I have one to this one also. So yeah, not a bad haul for today. And the last thing that I picked up was this gorgeous tray that I'm going to use on my coffee table. Nice and thick. And uh, let's see if I can turn it around with one hand. But um, it's actually Pampered Chef which their things last a long time. I love their products. And uh, this was $7.99. So 
going to clean it up. So today at the Salvation Army, everything with a blue tag and a white tag was 50% off. So I decided to pick up a few items of clothing. <laughs> Couldn't help myself. So their tops are usually about $3.99 to maybe $5, depending on what it is. But um, these were all blue tags, so they were 50% off. So I did pick up this beautiful summer top because you know it's nice and lightweight a little sheer i'll put a tank up under it but it was 50 percent off so it was like a dollar 99 see if i can just put this over there i also love when i find brand new items because this is still brand new still has the tags on it it is forever 21 and um it actually wasn't a blue or a white tag, but the girl marked it down anyway, so it came up to $1.99. And you can never have too many kimonos. I love my kimonos because you guys know I'm a modest dresser, so I've got to cover everything. And uh, these have these cute little tassels on here. So I love my tassels. I love my fringe. This beautiful kimono I actually picked up the night before at the Goodwill. And this one I didn't care if it was on sale. I actually paid full price for it, which was $8. But it is Alfani. And I love... The details on it, gorgeous tropical print, nice and sheer to, uh, yeah, I can go a whole lot this summer. I also found dresses. Love my dresses. You guys know I love my dresses long. Floor length is always best for me. This was also 50% off, but that was 50% off at the Goodwill long skirts picked up two long skirts one denim one 100% cotton I only wear 100% fabrics so these were also 50% off they were usually I think 549 or something like that and uh, yeah got those also half price gorgeous Jacqueline Smith top nice and long to cover really beautiful details also 50% off. So like I said, that was also like $1.99. Once again, I love finding brand new products. This beautiful dress was also blue tag. So it was 50% off. Very long, nice 100% fabric. And this was, I think, $4. a cute little top to go over a tank or something also 50% off the majority of the things that I found were actually 50% off most of the time the dresses are about $8.99 so you know when they're 50% off they come to about $4.50 $4.99 and um, this beautiful dress nice bright colors also floor length like I said, I love my floor length dresses. So that is a nice clothing haul. I did pick up another shirt that I don't have over here right now. But um, all of this, you guys, was less than $50. I also got this beautiful scarf. Nice, sheer, lightweight, neutral color, perfect for covering. And it was also blue tag. It was 50% off. So it was $1.50. I almost forgot about this pair of earrings. So I did pick up these earrings also. I have these in a bronze, coppery like color. But, you know, never hurts to have actual bright colors when it comes to jewelry. I don't wear a lot of jewelry, but I do wear earrings. And uh, sometimes I like them to be a little flashy. And these have... Gorgeous detail in them. It's kind of a iridescent to it. So, thought they were cute, so I picked them up. 
So you guys don't sleep on the thrift stores, especially nowadays. Nowadays, thrift stores are almost like regular stores as in they allow you to make returns. So like the Goodwill, the Goodwill is um, anything that is 50% off during the week on Thursdays, those items are a dollar. Doesn't matter if it's a couch, a teacup, a dress, or a pair of shoes. If it was 50% off on Thursdays, it is one dollar. They also allow you to make returns now. So if you have an item, you get it home, try it on, whatever, and you know it doesn't fit, or you find a, you know, something you don't like about it, you actually have 60 days to return it as long as you leave the tags on. So you know what? Like I said, with me, I wear 100% fabrics and it's kind of hard to find those in the regular stores. Everything is mixed now with spandex and, you know, 50% this, 50% that. So it's easier for me to go to the thrift store. I pay less money. I have a wider variety. It's not just what's in fashion at the time. And I actually can find older clothes that are better quality. And the last thing that I got was this pair of earrings. They were $2.99 simply because one of the earrings is missing just the little back stop. So they were $5.99 plus 50% off. And that doesn't bother me. I have tons of these little stoppers, so... I think I did great. Nice little haul. All for me. Well, of course, the stuff for the daycare kids. <laughs> and my grandkids. So, thanks for thrifting with me, you guys. And I will see you all in the next video. Stay blessed.